Yeah, no, we get Master Pack tickets. That's great and all, but the Master Packs are full of units that most people have at five stars already. Or just straight units that we don't fucking need. It's like, as good... As good as I do think... Um, this red Super Saiyan 3 Goku is... Outside of using him as a bench unit, what the fuck did we need him in Master Pack 3 for? I understand Master Pack 3 is just all the UST banners. But why is the purple Super Saiyan 3 Goku not in a Master Pack? I mean, for Christ's sake, Cell's pretty old at this point, yet they put him in, a, in the Legends Premium banner. It's like, why is it only limited to UST banners? Why can't we have the other banners as well? All the good units, most of the good units in the past came off of non-UST banners. Now UST units are really good. But before, most of the really good ones came outside of UST. I'm sorry, I'm trying to... I, I don't know what the fuck I was doing. And it's just like... I understand... You need to make money. So why not give free-to-play players... The extreme or higher ones... And then make the guaranteed sparkings... Um... Tickets you have to pay for. I'm not asking you to give us everything, but give us something. It's like, they, like, of course, they don't want you to be free to play. They want you to buy, the, they want you to spend your fucking money. Their goal is to try and entice you to spend money. They don't want free to play to be a thing. Even though I've in the past have given excellent points on how you could eliminate free to play completely and the thing is i i think i've said this before it's so it's much easier to be a free to play player in dokkan than it is in dragon ball legends i could legitimately not play legends or not play dokkan at all for like a month. And the game would have just given me enough crystals to do like six multi summons. If I don't play Legends for a month, I won't get a goddamn thing. I legitimately would not have gotten a fucking thing. It is so easy to get 50, um, Dragon Stones and Dokkan. However, getting a thousand crystals and legends is either specifically designated for a certain event or just a general pain in the ass. And even the events that give you a thousand crystals, you have to wait an entire week to finish. So it's just like, fuck off. <laughs> Battle with a green. Dragon Ball Legends is not a free-to-play friendly game. You can't convince me it's a free-to-play friendly game because like 70% of the shit they do, they do is tailored towards uh, you spending your money. They want you to buy crystals. They want you to buy these dumbass tickets. They want you to pay for everything. You either need to have the most supreme luck like there, there are only three ways to be a free-to-play player. Have the most supreme luck ever. Don't summon on the majority of banners and only summon for units you really fucking want. And no, I have no intention on spending, a, on doing a single multi when those units come out. I'll do my dailies. I'll do my dailies, but I will not do a single multi-summon on that banner. Not only do I not care enough about the units, but first of all, if Goku, if Rose Goku Black comes out, all my crystals will be gone anyway. <laughs> Just get that shit straight. But even if I do have any crystals left, no, 
I wouldn't. Because it's not worth it. As a free-to-play player, it's not worth it. They're not units I really want. But the problem with only going after units you really want is... Sometimes that shit don't work out. You save up. And here's the thing. During the anniversary, I loved playing Dragon Ball Legends during the anniversary. I was still 100% free to play like I am now. And still ended up spending 40,000 crystals during the anniversary. Why? Because the game actually gave us crystals. Why we can't just have that many crystals... Like, I'm not asking for a full 40k, but I feel like it, I feel like there should be no point where I don't have 10,000 crystals, even as a free-to-play player. Like, genuinely, I feel like there shouldn't be a point where I don't have at least 10,000. Yet, for me, having 6,000 is a lot. For, like, I've only ever one time surpassed 10,000, and that was during the anniversary. I have yet to do that a second time. Why? Because I actually want the fucking units that the game gives me. I should have gone up with that. I forgot what that did. Oh, it worked anyway. Huh. It's like, when you're, when you're pay to play, pay to win, however the fuck you want to say it, Having 20,000 crystals is just a thing. That's just, you know, what, what? You don't have 20k crystals? What the hell is wrong? Poor motherfucker. You, you, need, you need to start gathering up some money. But the fact that I have to be ultra conservative with my crystals, I cannot. Like, I, I want to go after the transforming cooler. I want to. I really want that cooler. But it's not worth it because there's a unit that I really want coming up. Maybe don't put the cunt in there. <laughs> I'll allow the, the thing, but. It's like, wait, you didn't spend $200 on crystals, you fucking poor cunt. Like, what, you couldn't even buy the sales crystals? Did you know that when crystals go on sale, you can get 2,000 crystals for 25 bucks? Great. Twelve and a half dollars per multi-summon. That's how much a multi-summon is worth. To Bandai Namco, on an on-sale multi-summon is worth twelve and a half bucks. House way. To me, a multi summon's worth like five. Five dollars. Without a sale. And it's just like, alright, fuck off. If crystals were five dollars, I would empty my goddamn bank account every fucking banner. <laughs> But there's also just the principle that I don't want to pay $40 for crystals. I don't want to pay $40 for fuck all. <laughs> or when it's on sale, $25. I don't want to spend 25 bucks for literally nothing. What did I need? A green? No, purple. Also, I just realized we've been doing another rant, boys. You know what that means? It's going on YouTube. So make sure you subscribe to the YouTube channel, youtube.com slash the DS Asylum. I don't know. Dragon Ball Legends is not a free-to-play friendly game. It hasn't been since the anniversary. 